Hi guys, in this today's video, we will uh, learn about macros and how to enable macros in service cloud. So basically, macros is a sales, uh, in Salesforce allow you to perform actions or repeated action in service cloud. So for example, if you are working on a case or a contact or a account or lead, there are some kind of there are some kind of steps which we have to repeatedly used so what and it required multiple clicks or some kind of writing skills or some field updation or some kind of thing so what macros to do what may macros will make you step by step instruction so that you can automate the instruction so whenever we need uh, whenever we need to uh, perform that action we can just play the macros and that action is automatically performed. Now let's see how to enable macros. To enable macros, we have to add the macros in our utility item from app, app manager. So for app manager, we can go to setup. <coughs> From setup, we will go to app manager. From app manager, we will go to service console. May I read that? And from utility item, we can add that. Now, after adding the macros, we need to go. From here, we can ask for, you can see that macros is here. Now, we can create new macros from here as well. And we can create it from here and write macros. So let's get on yes, we can find this. We have to name it. So basically the name update case to working. So we are updating like whenever agent is working, it will uh, play the macros and it will update the status of the case to working. Okay, now from edit instruction, we have to edit the instruction. Now we'll add an instruction. Then we click on this region. Now we have to set the status working. We'll set priority to medium and we'll say like priority okay. test is working. Uh, we can set up we are testing macros and we will then click on save so this particular act can means like after this macro is done this action can be undone so if we are not doing this we can undo these particular steps but if we are submitting or click on save then this particular macros will not be undone by any chance. We will save this one. Then we go to here, refresh it. One cases. Let's check the case. 
and here you can see that we have our update case system and we will just run this so you can see after running this macro the state is already changed to work right to medium and we are testing macros so this is how we use macros thanks